Bloxroots is uh, in quite the situation right now. There is an increasing number of people that are kind of getting really impatient, which is pretty reasonable. I can't say it's not reasonable. So as everyone knows, Bloxroots had a roadmap. They, they pretty much delivered on everything that was on the roadmap almost. And the ghost event, I think there was just like a few days late, which was okay. I think Kitsune was maybe like, I don't know, maybe like a week past when it was supposed to come out. I'm not sure. They've been hitting all the released windows. And then there was the winter update when T-Rex came out. They kind of gave us half of that roadmap. We got T-Rex and a subclass. We didn't get Dragon or the fighting style. Which is, I think, the thing they were kind of planning on giving us. We didn't get any Please of that, fruit. and uh, I'm going Please somewhere fruit. else. <laughs> so people are at a point to where they're getting really impatient, and they're kind of waiting on this update. Come on, guys, have some patience. No plus ratio, plus plus update. And they've missed the release window for this update, according to the roadmap. They've missed the release window for this update by three months. That's a pretty huge deal. One month. That's not that bad. Two months, that's still really not that bad. Three months, we're kind of on the third month here. Now, the problem's not waiting for the update here. The problem is how far past the roadmap we already are. They followed two out of three of the things on the roadmap, maybe like two and a half out of the three things on the roadmap. We got one half of the winter update. We didn't get like the main stuff that people were excited for. Walt, please, please just hear me out, please. <laughs> and the whole dragon remodel thing in that situation so people are kind of getting tired of the game the reason people are getting so tired of the game so quickly even though it's only been like you know like two or three months so you guys know when update 17.3 came out right that update kept people entertained for a lot longer because there was a lot of stuff in it you had doe awakening you had leopard you had like 10 reworks you had a ton of stuff in that update so you know people could wait more longer but the thing is the updates that came out in december especially during halloween those updates were small updates small updates cannot keep people engaged for that long that's why people are only getting impatient after three months three or two months because if let's say the t-rex update if the t-rex update came with like an island and some new sea events and like a new fighting style, like a sword. The last update we got in the game was quite minuscule. It was very small, even in comparison to the Kitsune update. The Kitsune update had a new island, it had a new weapon, it had a new fruit, and it had quite a few accessories. This is even less substantial than that update. So when you have a smaller update, people aren't really gonna wait as long because there wasn't as much content. So Dragon is kind of the thing that people are the most excited about at the moment. Dragon is the thing everyone wants, and we're not really getting it. Why is this taking so long? I don't understand what's going on with Dragon. You think they would have had Dragon kind of partly finish in advance? Because, yeah, no. That's what Shafi did for T Rex. You know, Shafi made moves in advance for T Rex. And that's why, you know, T Rex saw a pretty easy release in, uh, in the winter update. It kind of makes me wonder, why didn't Dragon have some stuff done in advance? Especially when you announced it a year ago at this point. We're talking about February of last year. They, they, gotta, they gotta start bringing like, you know, the sword model reworks. You know, they gotta start bringing in like the map reworks. That's pretty much gonna be it. I know there's some people that are kind of getting upset with the developers, but I'm not really gonna say anything negative about them because... You never know, they could come, they could be working on something really massive.